Hi, yeah, my name is Jen. Um, I just wanted to give a word or two to some of the girls out there I know who are watching this. Um, just basically want to tell you a few things about myself. Um, I'm 29 at the moment, but um, at the moment it's not going to change. But when I was younger, when I was your age, when I was sort of 12, 13, 14, 15, um, and I was going through all the kind of changes that girls go through, I had such low self-confidence. Um, I was overweight, which didn't help, and people gave me a lot of stick about being overweight, um, which just made me eat more. Um, and if there was one thing that I could say to you, or a piece of advice I'd give to you, is that you need to believe that you're beautiful. Um, one of my favourite bits of the Bible, and I'm just going to turn around to read it, is, You're beautiful, my darling, beautiful beyond words. My lover said, Come away with me, my fair one. The winter's past. And that's something that I cling to, so much so that it's up on my wall there behind me. Um, because sometimes we forget and give ourselves a hard time and think we're not beautiful and actually God made every single person unique and we have our own beauty and we should never be scared to be who God made us to be. Um, I'm a youth worker and I just came home from work with something that I was going to put up on that board as well to encourage me and this is what it says. It's taken from a speech that um, was given by Nelson Mandela but it's written by Marianne Williamson um, and it says our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure it is our light not our darkness that most frightens us we ask ourselves who am I to be brilliant gorgeous talented fabulous actually who are you not to be you're a child of God you're playing small doesn't serve the world there's nothing enlightened about shrinking so that other people won't feel insecure around you we are all meant to shine as children do we were born to make and manifest the glory of God that is within us. It's not just in some of us, it's in everyone. And as we let our own light shine, we unconsciously give others per permission to do the same. As we are liberated from our own fear, our presence automatically liberates others. I think that just says that um, if you yourself and you're comfortable in who you are and you go with your style and don't worry about what other people say about you all the time, um, that you are actually helping other people to be themselves as well and not worry about what other people think. So if there's one thing I can encourage you, it's don't just try and fit in with the crowd. Do your own thing. Be who you were made to be. And if somebody gives you stick about it, just laugh it off and let it go. Because at the end of the day, you're beautiful just the way you are.